comes in, whatnot, with people having trouble importing, let's see, screen recordings recorded with, with QuickTime in Final Cut Pro. Now, you can go the route of, you can get programs like ScreenFlow and I show you, but those cost money. And you might just need to do a quick screen recording showing somebody something. Who knows what it is. I'm going to show you a good way to import those. Now, a lot of people said, oh, you got to bring it in iMovie and export it and whatnot. But you lose a whole lot of quality. I'm going to show you how to do it with compressor. This is assuming you have Final Cut Studio. Or that you have compressor. Okay, so that. So you bring in your screen recording, let's see. There's my sample recording. I'm just gonna drag and drop just like thing else, and then you I just set your settings to what you want. Um let's see. I'm going to do ProRes uh, high quality. I've just recently started messing with ProRes, so it's good. Trial and error. I'm going to name this a screen cord. Okay, so now it's going to do what compressor does, of course. Export and compress and whatnot. So after it finishes doing this, it's going to be in a, in a format that will be acceptable by Final Cut. Okay, so the stream record is finished exporting. I'm going to locate that. So there it is. I'm going to minimize all these windows and now I'm going to drag and drop my media into my clips browser and then I'm going to drag and drop it into my timeline and see it accepts it. So, yes. Yeah. So yeah, works pretty well. Experience.